Hey, what's up guys? Good morning. So, you know, we're just kind of waking up a little bit and then Junji was like, hey, do you want anything? I was like, yeah, I'll be fine with just coffee. And then this was all here on the table. <laughs> Thanks a lot, man. Hey, welcome. He's, he's still cooking something back there. I don't even know what he's doing. I actually just got a text message from CGC saying that the comic books are ready and I wish I knew that they were going to text me all that information instead of me just going back and forth. Hey, are they ready? Hey, are they ready? No, they're not ready. Hey, are they ready now? No, they're not ready. They definitely are in fact ready for pickup. <laughs> He ran out of gas again. It's so annoying. What are we supposed to do now? So you're helping him out? Yeah, I just dropped okay. off some gas for him. Okay, cool. Yeah, is it? Do I just should just get out of the way, or? I'll sit here until he gets everything good to go. Okay. That way, you can both get out of here. You don't get hit. Okay, thank you. Yep. Yep. No problem. <laughs> do you know him, or just have? Oh to... no, I know him. Okay. <laughs> yeah. All right, I'll sit here a few minutes while he's going on with you. All right, thank you. Thought he was going to yell and tell us to tell me to move, but he's actually a cool cop. He's got the last drop going, and then we're on our way to Comic Con. All right, he's got it. All right, he's got it. All right, here we go. Moment of truth. I kind of don't even want to look at the grades until I get home and kind of make it a surprise, and then I'll tell you guys what these things are worth now that they've been graded and slammed. Okay, here's one. And the other six. Just need signature anywhere in the middle on both of them. All right, so uh, I'm slightly disappointed. <laughs> Did you know this was, uh, you know, was this color? Yeah, I know. It's always a bummer, I know. I, we send stuff in all the time, and uh, I have a pretty decent eye for it. But I miss it too, and like it's, yeah, it it's said always like something yeah. like minor touch ups or yeah, something. Yeah, minor color touch on the back. Like a four, like a four uh, blue label is around a thousand bucks. Yeah. Right. So if there's restoration to it, depending on what it is, like trimming is like the worst thing that you can do to this. So this is not trimmed, so that's fine. Color touch isn't that bad. It still detracts from the value, obviously. Um, some people do half, some people do like three quarters, but like it's probably around 600. Like okay. safely, I'd say probably 600. 600, okay. Yeah, and yeah. How much is that yeah. going for? That is $65,000. I'll do so, a trade if you're okay with that. Um, I, would, I would need <laughs> this and then probably a lot more like kidneys or cars or something. <laughs> I think he's willing to offer. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh. Yeah? yeah? I'm not really going to take it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Too funny. To All right, man. Okay. I'll see you. Bye. See ya. <laughs> Alright, see you dude. Have fun. Have fun, you too. Alright, thanks. Have a safe drive. Thank yeah, you. Call me. Yeah, I'll let you know. Alright, so now that I have all my comic books graded by CGC, I can tell you what all these comic books are now worth. These are the ones I just got graded, and these are some that I've already had, so I'll cover the ones I just got graded, and then I'll just go over these other books that I have. So, Amazing Spider-Man number two got a 4.0 grading but it's a restored comic book, which I'm really not happy about. It does look good. I didn't really notice any of it, but I guess CGC found it. They're much better than me. So um, I got a 4.0, but I couldn't find a 4.0 online, but I did find a 3.5 as well as a 5.0. Now the 3.5 goes for about 500 bucks and the 5.0, the max that I've seen for sale was 14.27, so $1,427. So I guess this does put the book somewhere around 600 bucks now that it is restored. <laughs> All right, next book is Amazing Spider-Man 194, which is a nice, nice copy. It's uh, 8.0 grading, and uh, I saw that going for about 165 bucks. So not too bad. Next book I have here is Amazing Spider-Man number 300, which before I got this graded, I honestly thought it was going to be closer to a nine, but it got a 7.5, and I saw that going for about 270 bucks. Uh, now I got all my Amazing Spider-Man 361s, so this is the first appearance of Carnage. So this is a 9.0, uh, this is about 105 bucks. I got the 9.2 here, it's about 170, 9.2, really nice. And the 9.6 is about 
195 bucks. Pretty cool. Uh, now my last book here is Secret Wars number eight. And that's a 7.5, thought it was gonna be higher, 56 bucks. So, uh, before I brought those in to get graded, I honestly thought they were all gonna be much higher than what I got on there. And I really didn't expect that, that Amazing Spider-Man number two to be a restored copy. Like, that just blew me away. And I'm still just really upset about the, about that. But uh, I'm gonna go over some of the, uh, the books that I've already had that have already been graded and I bought them as is. So this is Amazing Spider-Man number 252. And that's about 105 bucks. Nice copy. 9.0 uh, The next one I have here is Ghost Rider. This is the first issue uh, Not the first appearance, uh, but this is Ghost Rider number one. It's a 7.5 and that's uh, what do I got here? Uh, 238 bucks Then I have here Amazing Spider-Man number 238 uh, First appearance of Hobgoblin and the tattoos are inside and that's a 9.4 and that is $332. Now here I have Batman number 232. This is the first appearance of Ra's al Ghul. Uh, so this is a 7.5 and that goes for about, what do I have here? 455. And my last book, this is an awesome book. So this is the first appearance of The Punisher number 129, Amazing Spider-Man number 129. The show's coming out soon. I'm pretty excited about it on Netflix, so I don't know. I can't wait to check that out when it comes out. But uh, this one, Amazing Spider-Man number 129, 8.0, 11.25, so 1,125 bucks. Um, but yeah, I mean, that's pretty much it. Now you kind of know what these comics are sort of worth, and now I know too. I already knew those, but uh, these, you know, it is what it is. I wish they were higher, but I mean, I, I do have a few other books, but they're not graded. They're just raw copies. Uh, but yeah, that's it. Thanks for stopping by and checking out this vlog, and I will see you in my next one. All right, bye.